kind of levels I like are a little ways away if I even do the other episodes. And it crashed. Well, it shouldn't be doing that. Huh. Probably won't be. Luckily I've got scuba gear, so it didn't bother me to stay underwater for any length of time. There's those things again. And it has crashed. Son of a bitch. Okay, so here is my plan. It's crashed a few times on me, and usually right about the same spot, right outside that submarine. So what I think I'm going to try is to see if, uh, if it's something with the save file itself. And I'm just going to start from that level, which means I won't have any of my gear, but if it doesn't crash, I'll consider that a plus. Toxic dump, right? Yeah. I was on let, Let's Rock difficulty, which is like medium. So, wish me luck. Or don't, because if you see this, it's worked. At least I've gotten good at the buttons. And I don't have my scuba gear anymore, so I need to be careful of spending time underwater. drowning. Boy, doesn't take long, does it? The, uh, the Octobrains, at a distance, I got kind of trapped on a wall. Never mind. I was gonna say they're not too threatening, but I took a hit. And less than half life. A little bummed out that I lost my rocket launcher and all that, but say la vie. Duke Nukem's pretty generous with the items. Surely I can pick them back up. Probably pretty quickly, actually. And I haven't crashed, so... You know, step in the right direction. Yeah, rocket launcher. RPG, force of habit. Oh, good lord. Well, just... I'm not a fan of those automated little turrets. Let's see. I feel like there should be a secret to one of those. Well, doesn't matter if there was. I kind of screwed that. Okay, so it looks like the problem was with the save file, so I'm going to go ahead and keep on. Huh. I don't know how far I'm going to get, though. It's an interesting place to put a camera. And my HUD's still messed up. I was kind of hoping that would fix with the new game. It's only a minor problem, though. Nice. Neither of them dropped ammo? No. Oh, I hear a pig. Pig cop. Not really the kind of enemy I want to run up and kick, but they've got those shotguns. Which aren't exactly safe at long range, but, you know, 
You know how shotguns are in video games. Whoa, that is way too many. Uh, Carpe Diem. Which is the second non English expression I've used to say screw it. Always happy to have more ammo. So yeah, before it crashed, or maybe it wasn't before it crashed, it's hard to tell because it's happened a few times. I've tried to start this level off a few times. I was talking about how the uh, for a little while after this, the levels aren't going to be the kind that I like. But uh, still though, pretty solid level design, just for more... Uh, this is much more Doom looking to me. Just sort of that industrial, technological, you know. I don't want to say generic, I mean. It's not to say that they are without creativity. Oh, I forgot, you can respawn like minutes before. That's a little, uh, that's comforting. A little frazzled by all the crashing and stuff that's gone on, so I'm kind of at a loss for words because I'm not even sure what I've said or not said yet. What's been recorded and what's been deleted. But this is the furthest I've been, so. It's all new territory. New ish. Territory from here. You know, I think that's the first screen I've seen that hasn't been broken. happy to have that. So I picked up the red key card. I do remember where that is and I do know what's coming next. Pretty novel little uh, little use of the game mechanics actually. Let me turn run mode on because I do not want to dawdle. Okay. Emergency lock. Yeah, it still gives little touches like that. Little labels and things to kind of show you what's going on. And uh, after the next few levels, the beginning of episode two, actually. What the? Uh, episode two, as I was saying, takes place on the moon. So, not a lot of familiar environments there, but they do have nice little touches. Like, you know, things that are obviously bathrooms, or they'll have them labeled barracks, or... You know, things like that to kind of show you what in-universe you're dealing with. Well, that 
opened a door. An underwater door. I can hear an octobrain, so it's pretty close because I've got the sound turned down. It's probably right under the water. Or maybe I'm just wrong. It's been known to happen. As I was saying the other day, this came out, the, the, the Duke Nukem 3D, I should say, came out in, uh, 96, so I'm a little irked that it's crashing on a much, much more powerful system than a PC was back then. I've been pretty good about it so far. I don't know if it keeps if it crashes again if it becomes the thing I'm just gonna cut it. There is a long list of games that we started and did not finish, including Doom, which I keep talking about while I'm doing this. There's my gate. crashes again, I'll go back and do some levels on Doom. But, uh, whoop! Huh. Rocket launchers are fun. wondering why I did that, I saw a cracked wall. I kinda wanna explore it. That was not the cracked wall. That was the cracked wall. So it's taking steroids and run mode just to keep off of the the flow there. Oh crap, I'm in it again. Did that say a very happy place? Or a very secret place? I'll have to... I don't know what it said. But I'm back in the water flow, so. What did I pick up? Rockets? I guess that makes sense. It took me a rocket to get in there. It's a weird day when rockets are so expendable that shotgun shells are precious. Just a clip, that's nice. If I'm lucky I'll pick up a ripper because I picked up a few boxes of ripper ammo. got a good attitude for a man who's surrounded by constant death and war. And, you know, women and... Well, I guess really just women. You don't see many men struggling in this universe. Other than Duke himself, I suppose. Shoot. 
Well, what I need to do here is pretty clear. I need to bring the two platforms together and then run across, or maybe jump across. Now, nah, run. And, uh, it'll pull me to the other side. Dang it all. Alright. Had a feeling. Well, I can see it, Shadow. Maybe I'll explore up there. Nope. I cannot jump that high. And I don't have a jetpack. Or protective boots. So I need to just go about my business. That's pretty cool. It's the little touches that you've got to stop and appreciate. Corpses floating merrily along their way down the sewer. Space is a little tight for a rocket launcher, but don't have much choice at this point. Lost all my gear when I had to restart. Oh, the restart's a little harsh when I had to, uh, Cheat the system, I guess. Yeah, he's gonna chew on me if I stay. Uh. Huh. Uh. Huh. Why? Maybe if I had a jetpack, which I probably did before I, uh. Well, you know. Oh, good. A great decision on my part. Although it looked like that teleporter saved me from a little mind blast thing. Whatever, I'm out of here. Ah, thanks for sticking with me. I'll see you next time.